Biceps grow best through metabolic pathways as opposed to muscle damage, mechanical pathways. When we can create a good burn in the muscle, we're going to increase stem cell activity. We're going to get release of IGF-1, insulin-like growth factor one in the muscle and an increase in protein synthesis. All of these are gonna help that muscle grow. We do this by getting a good burn in the muscle. We want lactic acid. Okay. We want reps between 40 to 70 seconds. So for most of us, that's gonna put us in the 10 to 15 rep range. And we want constant tension on the muscle. This means no locking out at the bottom, that's gonna allow that muscle to rest, bring oxygen in, and no cheat reps because that's gonna take tension off the muscle. So we're looking for more on the biceps, about a three quarter rep, nice and slow up, nice and slow down. Keep your rest periods between sets short. Uh, we're looking for muscle fatigue here, so 30 to 60 seconds. If you're going to superset this with say like a tricep exercise, keep it more like 30 seconds. So barbell bicep curl, 30 second rest, rope tricep extension, 30 second rest. That gives you a good 60 seconds of non-working time between your sets of biceps. So as much fatigue into the muscles you can get, watch them grow.